field goal range, and that's something that we did not do. Coach Mack completed the pass to Devin. I believe it was Heron. He made it third to 55 seconds. Uh, you call a timeout. What was the thinking behind that? Uh, well, we wanted to get the, we wanted to get our best play for uh, third and two to try to uh, earn the first down. That was our, you know, that was our thought. We were right on, you know, we were right on the edge in terms of uh, where we wanted to be in terms of field goal. We wanted to get a first down. Uh, the look that they gave us said. Mac today seemed uh, a little bit off. Uh, just talk about him. I mean, I mean of course, I you need him to be at the top of his game. We need, we, need, we need all of us to be at the top of our game uh, to win. Uh, not just our quarterback, but we all need to. Uh, we did not uh, stop the run in the second half of the ball game. Uh, we gave up you know, a 23 and a 20 yard run. Um, missed tackles on two of uh, on one of them. Two missed tackles on, on the touchdown run, and then uh, we lost leverage and didn't keep. He stuffed the line and uh, the ball bounced, you know, the ball bounced outside and we did not have uh, the proper leverage. So we gotta play, you know, we gotta play better as a whole. I know it's frustrating, Coach, because you saw the inconsistency in the first half with two turnovers you guys had. The defense only held them to field goals instead of touchdowns. And then in the fourth quarter, the two big interceptions to set you guys up in position to win. Is the inconsistencies that are frustrating? It's very frustrating when you don't play consistent football. We train all week. These guys work extremely hard. The players, the coaches, we, we, we train and we have an opportunity to play uh, once a week. And when you don't play consistently, uh, you're not going to get the outcome that you want. We were inconsistent as a football team, basically, on, on both sides of the ball. There were some very good things and some very good plays. But when uh, you're not consistent, you're not going to uh, make the plays when you need to. And that was the case in point today. I, I, like understand, I understand that you, obviously, if you get the first down on third and two, the game changes. But is there any reluctance on your part there when you know that you're looking at a 53-yarder from a guy who's been really good to think, we want to keep the clock moving here and make them call their time Again, out? Again, you can, yes, you can, have, you can uh, definitely ask that question. The 53-yarder was definitely outside the range that we had set prior to the, you know, prior to the game. Uh, outside. Yes. Yeah. Yes. We wanted to, you know, we wanted to get a first down. We felt like we, uh, you know, we had a play. We, that's why we called the timeout. Didn't know we're in, uh, you know, use. If they would have used their, you know, they would have used the timeout. Probably if we had. Did that on the pass rush today? I thought it was uh, like the way that we played, the way that we coached. It was inconsistent. Uh, there was some, there was some pressure, but there were some times when uh, it was. Uh, with Gordon the back. The quarterback back there uh, was able to, uh, you know, to throw the ball down the field some. With Gordon back, the Browns receivers present a variety of different problems. How do you feel about the way you played against the Browns? Receivers? Well, uh, you know, Josh Gordon's a very good receiver. Um, he made some plays today uh, in the game. You can tell they're a better football team when they have Josh Gordon uh, out there. It's a dynamic group of uh, of receivers in terms of speed. And uh, when you have Josh Gordon, he's a you know he's a good sized receiver that runs extremely well. And he does create matchup issues. What was happening in the run game? They were giving up 140 today to our yeah, time. We did not. We did not run the ball efficiently, uh, especially uh, there in the first half of the ball game. They had been giving up uh, giving up yards behind you know, the top uh, rushing defenses. Uh, they did load the box uh, against us. Thank you. All right, thank you.